What are you still doing here? Everyone should clear out of the city. The Combine's not making it easy. We're trying to get enough people together to force our way through to the train station. People are meeting up in a safe house nearby. Can you take us there? You bet. Let's go. This way. Hey, it's me. Open the door. What's the password? I'm not even gonna tell you to shut up. Come on in. Previously, certain protein chains important to the process of embryonic development were selectively prevented from forming. This is no longer the case. For those so inclined, now would be an excellent time for procreation. Which is to say, in layman's terms, you should give serious consideration to doing your part for the revival of the species. We must make the most of the time we have, as it is by no means certain how much time we have secured ourselves before the Combine attempt to restore their dominion, as they certainly shall. Since this is, in fact, the first opportunity we have had to speak openly of the baleful influence of the Combine, there is much ground to cover. And, in fact, I hope to institute a series of useful bulletins in the days ahead. However, for now, we will have to content ourselves with some relatively eager exposition. The destabilization of the City-17 reactor has had repercussions that were not entirely unexpected, although we hardly dared speak this hope ahead of time. The destructive pulse forced a damper on the entire network of linked Citadel reactors. Thus, for the time being, I believe that all Combine portals have failed completely, as well as all communications systems based on that technology. In short, the Combine are completely cut off. Combine forces currently stationed on Earth are now isolated units, stranded. However, this is most likely a temporary state of affairs. As we once learned to our dismay, even the relatively tiny fracture and black maker gave our enemies an opening. Let's find they another way up. Force ever wider as they poured through in greater and greater numbers. In addition to completely xenotheric species, there are many modified post human allies still remaining on Earth who will be doing their utmost to re-establish lines of communication and supply with the larger forces. Even so, there is greater reason for hope now than at any time in the past decade. We have made, in secret, several technological advances which we will do our best to deploy in advance of the combined We continue to diligently assemble and train a new generation of scientists and technicians. For what the Combine fear the most is not any but our of our intellect, our ability to respond to our passion to every terror we place our firmament even knowing how easily it may be shattered. We have all seen friends and family crushed by the Combine. Some of our neighbors have allowed themselves to be co-opted and purged of their humanity by the military machine. And those who have met a terrible fate. As you can imagine, we have had scarcely time to record, let alone rehearse. What's that, Eli? Oh, right. This has been Dr. Isaac Kleiner, formerly of Black Mesa, now simply a citizen, like all of you of Earth. Let me just add to all those who can hear me now, as we struggle out of the shadow of our malefactors, welcome back to the light. I blame Odessa Cubbage. Between you and me, I don't trust those Vortigons. I blame Black Mesa. K 
Careful, Lamar. These lamps are quite hot. So much for better living through science. Dr. Kleiner says we can mate now. Not that I Is needed his on? permission. Yes. What Very idiot well. put Kleiner I, in charge? I am not much of a public speaker. Sometimes I think everybody's a I'll doctor do but me. <clears throat> Everything we do seems to make Fellow things worse. Citizens, this was such a nice neighborhood, too. Of city 17 it must be and environs. We're sitting ducks in here. Or maybe fish course, in a barrel. And anyway, otherwise. it's not good. I believe there is little need to explain recent Here's developments to our Vortigaunt allies. <laughs> At any rate, <clears throat> first... As a matter of great urgency, if you find yourself still within the confines of City 17, you are well advised to leave the city at once by the fastest means available to you. We have restored service to much of the commuter transport system in order to carry citizens out of the city as quickly as possible. We have also established camps and triage areas in the surrounding environs. I repeat... You must evacuate the city at once. While there was certainly a great benefit in the city, we have to one round of unfortunate. That one's gonna blow! Nice punch! In a destructive event whose magnitude I cannot currently estimate with any certainty, except to say that it will all. Gordon? Alex? I don't believe it. How the hell did you get out of the Citadel? We're not exactly sure. All I know is the Vortigons had something to do with it. But what about you, Barney? I'm doing okay, just going crazy trying to... They found us! Aw, oh, hell, Gordon? Were you followed again? We stole some information from the Citadel on our way out. I don't know what it is yet, but it's important enough that they've been hounding us the whole way here. Well, that puts the pressure on. Look, we gotta get moving. You guys know about the evacuation trains, right? Yeah. Yeah, well, we've been planning to make a push on the train station. Now it looks like we're gonna have to cut a path through every chicken ship metro cop who's having second thoughts about defending City 17. If Gordon and I took a separate route, we could draw the Combine away from you. That'd give you a chance to get the trains filled up before we get there. Really? Well, if you say so... Now, come here, look over here. Okay, across this bridge, over the rooftops, is a safe path to the station. You two head that way. I'll hit the streets and round up everyone who's been waiting. We'll meet you there. Sounds good. Let's go. Hey, Gordon, before you go, I was getting tired of carrying this around. Listen, I don't have many more of these, so try not to lose this one, okay? Go on across, Gordon. She's waiting for you.
supplies.
Jesus, Gordon, you're a real terror. Think it's dead? Maybe you should wake up with the crowbar just in case. Oh, God, not again. So much for medical supplies. I found a shot.
God, more zombies! Gordon, I got a bit swamped.
hospital is this? Mm-hmm. 